What's up guys, Esgoodman52, welcome back to the channel where today we are going to be reviewing How to Read Minds by Peter Turner and Illusionist. If you haven't already, make sure that you give us a like, you subscribe if you're new to the channel, and as always, drop a comment down below, and now the boring stuff's out of the way, uh, let's get into it. <laughs> Like I said at the beginning of the video, we are going to be reviewing How to Read Minds by Peter Turner and Illusionist. This, I'm just so excited for this because this is a Kickstarter campaign that they put out uh, just before Christmas and it was fulfilled and they managed to do the shipping really quickly and get it out to everyone before Christmas. So this turned up on Christmas Eve, which is like the best Christmas present ever. Inside, you will find 20 different routines that you can perform as well as 14 gimmicks that they give you full instructions for. This has over seven and a half hours of video tutorial by Peter Turner that explains the trick, explains the variations on them, gives you a video on the performance so you can see how they're put into real world practices. As well as that, he gives you some tips and tricks on how to use them and apply them and certain little tips and tricks that make the gimmicks that are included a little bit more believable. And as well as that, it just sets you up very well this is probably one of the best kits that you could get if you wanted to be starting into mentalism. Give you a few little props to work with, a few little ideas, and those of you who don't, don't know Peter Turner, all of his ideas are very simple. Very simple scripts, very simple ideas, but they give a large and sort of like an epic effect. You build to this magical moment at the end where you reveal something to the spectator, and it truly is amazing, which is why I couldn't wait to get my hands on this. So, the box in itself is a very nice design. You have this sort of like, Black on white, that's it. There's two colours, black and white. We've got these really simplistic symbols in the middle. We've got the skull, we've got the brain waves coming in and out like you're reading a mind. We've got this iron key logo, uh, and on the back we've got a load of like ad work by Illusionist that says, um, with how to read minds, you'll learn skills no one thought you'd have, skills you didn't know existed, reveal secrets about them ever saying a word. Whatever you use these skills for, we can guarantee one thing, no one will ever call you boring. Inside, you will have the skills to create mayhem, madness, and mentalism. So, first things first with this box when you open it. Inside, you are greeted with two different layers of gimmicks. So this is the first part, and then you pull that up, and there are more bits inside underneath. With this, you will receive stuff to do a book test. You'll get billet cards, you get mark deck, you get credit card, you get spoon to bend, UV lighting, ESP cards, but the main thing that you get inside is no instructions. So for any of you who have this, uh, have just opened it and you're kind of wondering uh, where the instructions are, I will show you. Inside you will find this stainless steel metal card that's kind of like a credit card from like a MasterCard or something. It does look pretty normal but you have like similar artwork to the front, however there's this iron key and if you just push on that it spins around and this is actually a USB device that has all of the videos on there. You have 20 videos on the tricks, you have one as an intro, you have another video telling you where to get refills for some of the gimmicks that are inside and as well as that you also have a video full of the performances of every single trick where they show you how things are done. What I really like with this project and like I said before this is a very simplistic tricks. Very simple but they have big effect and what I like about that is mentalism doesn't have to be over the top. It doesn't have to be too much but there's small little slights that you can do and as long as you present them correctly, it will give such good reactions to the spectators. One of the cool things that you can do with this kit is you can unlock people's iPhones, you can do a mind reading in terms of people coming up with a name and you, you pull that name and get that connection from them. And the whole point of Peter Turner's work, if no one knows Peter Turner, is the idea of how you present this builds and builds and builds and you it becomes more believable instead of you just quickly revealing it there's a certain pattern you go through to get to that point now Peter Turner I've met before in Leeds when Daniel Madison did a meetup and I was up there and I met one of my good friends who actually suggested I do this review for the channel so I just want to give a shout out to Tom Savage this one's for you buddy Peter Turner an excellent performer the way he performs his magic again is the magic part is really good the mentalism really good but it's the actual performance the sort of the allurement around it and that's what he puts into this. So he is on every single video giving you a tutorial on how to do the trick. As well as that, he does have someone from Illusionist there that will then act as a spectator but also pose questions that you might yourself have. So for example, on the billet trick video, he's asking questions about could you do it this way, could you do it that way? Certain things that you're asking that you wouldn't really think of yourself or certain questions that you have when you watch a video tutorial but oh, what about this bit? They cover that because there's someone asking the questions like a novice person would ask. In terms of this kit, I would definitely say that this is, if you've not done mentalism before, this is definitely for you. This is a way to get into mentalism. But as well as that, if you are an experienced person in mentalism 
and you just want some great kit, great knowledge, great videos, some routines to do, or just a refresher on mentalism, I definitely suggest this kit. Now this is expensive, I will add that, so they're selling them things still on the Illusionist website around about £100 or $100. I got this on the Kickstarter campaign and because I was an early bird backer on that, I managed to get two apps as well. So Tempest and Cypher, which are two incredible apps that um, I think they were produced by Lloyd Barnes or for Illusionist, I can't remember. One of them was done by Lloyd, I'm pretty sure. They are incredible apps that you can use with the kit in order to do great mentalism effects. So you can extrapolate these simple 20 effects out and do so much more with them. So for example, book test, you could do some equivocate with that while building it into the book test. Then you can go on to doing like a billet trick mind reading. You could combine them to two together. It really is a very versatile kit. And like they say on the video, this is something that, you know, no one's expected to like every single piece in there. However, what they suggest is you take a couple of items, go out, practice with them, perform with them, see how you get on with it, and then go on to do some other bits. And that's what I like about this kit, is there's a bit of something for everyone in there. So I definitely suggest, if mentalism is the way you want to get into it and you want to learn some bits, I would definitely suggest using this as a starting point. And then from that point onwards, you can then start looking into like certain different elements or different people's performances or anything like that and then go for it that way. Now this is the point where I would probably say, let's go out and go perform some of these things, but I'm not gonna do it to the camera, because that kind of, like with card magic, you can perform it to the camera, people can visually see it. This is something that you'd have to practice a while, and then go perform to people. I've only had this a couple of days, and I really wanna get this review out for you guys, but in the future, I will do some of the tricks to people and try and get them filmed, uh, and then I'll put up like a little compilation of those, or just put some bits and bobs up as I'm putting videos. So stay tuned for that, make sure you are subscribed for that. So in summary for this kit, is this something you should get? 100% if you are interested in mentalism. The video production done on the tutorials is incredible. Some of them span from 50 minutes to just eight minutes. It really does depend on the actual trick, but they go into full detail and depth and explain everything that you can want, as well as having a performance so you kind of know how it should be performed. The gimmicks inside are some of them are quite simple and you could probably make yourself out of bits of card and stuff like that. However, there is the ability to then refill the kit. So don't be afraid to use these and go, oh, you know, I should only use it on certain performances. Go, go ahead and use them. They, they are, there are refills available and there are ways that you can make the gimmicks yourself. So do, or well, the, I say the gimmicks, the, the refill items in order to do mentalism tricks. So definitely go out and perform this. Definitely go out and have fun with this and enjoy it. And in terms of like the, the things that are included, I mean, I've never done ESP cards before but it's something that I've been interested in. And now with this kit, I get a full explanation, I get the cards as well, and I get some ways that I can perform it in different ways. So there's something that I can now build into my magic and then use that. You can carry them around in a little sleeve, ready to go, pull them out your pocket, have you ever tried this? Everything that Pete does allows it to be a very natural and organic magic, rather than it being like, oh, look at this, I have this strange bar mat that I, I've just pulled out my bag and I can do, do you know what I mean? It is very organic. You can, you know, I think in the performance in the video, he talks about, I think he puts, one of the, the book tests on the actual shelf and makes the spectator believe that it's their book and then he like forces them to choose it by random from their bookshelf so it just shows the amount of power that you can get from just such a simple idea or something like that okay guys so if you have enjoyed this video make sure you give it a like you subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with some new videos and now we're a little bit more set up in the house um, we're going to be producing a lot more content going forward stay tuned for updates on what's to come in 2020 and one last thing big shout out to jack moore who is my top subscriber at the minute, watching all my videos, commenting on them, liking on everything, um, and every time I see him about an Ipswich, he's always quoting my videos to me. So, <laughs> yeah, thank you very much, Jack. So yeah, guys, hope you have enjoyed the video. Like I said, drop a comment down below and all that sort of stuff, and I shall see you on the next one. Bye.